Tone? Uh-uh. You uh, understand what happened? Yes. Okay. What do you think it's about? What Chuck said. What Chuck said? That what happened to Duck would happen to me. The fuck he did? I swear. Sorry. You took some sense into it. Don't be mad. <coughs> hey. How you doing? I don't care what reason you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Because she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. If y'all keep going on like this, then that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? We find a boat. You think that's a new idea? You got even the foggiest idea about where you're gonna find one of those. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. Like a gun. Are you kidding me? What? She's too young to handle one? There ain't too young. Not anymore. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past oh, 14 years now. Sorry to hear that. No one to blame. You're homeless then? Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and they just don't work out. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. Got any? No. Darn. <coughs> mm, sorry about that. But... Wow, this game. I shot the kid, you know. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean, when we get to Savannah. We got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. Be safe up here. You betcha. Hey. Yo. It's full of maps and documents. Mind if I get by you for a second, Kitty? Can you just leave me alone? It'll be good to get to the water. You still want to get a boat? It's still the best plan. You can. It's the best plan. Hey. Yeah? Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. If I look in there for a second, I really wish you'd just leave me alone. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. You told us it was your parents' store back in Macon. That was enough personal information. I'm sure. Can't. 
would be uh, okay with you. So forget it. Okay. All right. Hey, Ben. Hey. Doug saved your life, you know. I know, I know. I don't know if I can go on like this, man. Well, you're gonna. That's just the way it is. Aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. We're all homeless. You know what I mean. There's not much use in describing people by who they were. Yeah, I guess not. They see you. Yeah. The door to the boxcar. <laughs> Looks like Chuck has some booze left. A fifth of whiskey. I'll keep that. We're not on this train much longer. There's some scissors in Chuck's bag. He's lived here a while. Should I get to this guy? Ah, let's go. Head out towards the gap. God damn it. Let's get him drunk. Nope. Damn it. I found this if you want it. Realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? No, I'm fine. Suit yourself. Mm. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. All right. Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some? Yeah. Alright, yeah. let's get the mobs. Help. Well, I got him drunk. was a map of Savannah in the cab. That's where I would look. I'll talk it over with Clementine. Make sure she's got a sense of things by the time we arrive. Good. Giving the bandits supplies. What? I know it. It's all my fault. What for? Why the hell would you do this? They said they had my friend, that he was with them. By the time I realized they didn't, it was too late. They said they'd kill me. Kill all of us. I'm sorry, Lee. Do you still want to talk to me? Yeah, I do. I'm real sorry. Let's drop it for now, okay? What are you doing out here? 
I, uh, couldn't be back there anymore. I needed some air. Anything else? I was thinking about talking to Kenny. I guess not. I'm dead serious about you keeping your mistakes to yourself. I can tell. You get why, right? I guess. You better. See you. Yeah. All right. I know that he did it. Stay there. I blame that bitch for killing dog. <laughs> hey, Clint. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some. Uh, he explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you, but there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay, what should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and uh, tidy up a little so you can't get grabbed so easily. I like that. Good. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? When you're ready to shoot, make sure you're not breathing too hard. And then hold your breath right when you pull the trigger. Like when I'm swimming? Oh, just for a quick second. I found that if I did that, it's a lot more accurate. It's tough, but it'll help. I can do that. Okay. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah, you do. Steady now. Okay, a little higher. Okay, aim a little bit more to the left. Aim a little higher. Okay. Close. Now keep it steady. Aim lower. Hooray! There's a drum. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. Good job. I was holding my breath, and the gun didn't shake so much. See, you did good. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay, I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. hurt and my ears have noise in them like you'll get used to it I want to talk about Savannah me too and what we're gonna do when we get there we don't know what to expect 
The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. We need to help find a boat. It's our best bet at safety. Okay, but we'll be in Savannah, and my parents were in Savannah. I know. Look. No, I don't care about safety. I care about finding them. Okay, we'll look for them. Really? Yes, of course. I'm sorry. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. Okay, let's. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. We're gonna want to look for a boat here, I imagine. And from there, we've got all the Savannah to the southwest of us. Now we've got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm... Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. There are a lot of hotels on here, but read this map and... Maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the... M... M... something... Mar... Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. Yes! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I... tell my parents? You know... Sure. Go ahead. How you doing? Good. I'm glad we have a plan. Me too. What do you think about Chuck? I don't know. Me neither. He might be an okay guy though. You think? We'll keep an open mind about him. He's probably had it pretty rough. Be careful around Ben. I like Ben. I know. He's just young and doesn't make the best choices. I'm young. You're smart. Just listen to me, okay? And be careful. Burned. I need to look around for a few things that'll make sure we're prepared when we get to Savannah. That would be good. I hope it's safe there. Yeah, me too. Okay, where did he say that his scissors are? smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. Mind if we do this now? I guess not. Don't mope. It's a good thing. Alright, let's play a haircut. Do you know how to do this? Nope, no idea. I'm not much of a stylist, you know. I'm going to look like a boy. But think how much safer you'll be. I'd rather be dead. Shush now. Wait, what the hell? So you did kill someone before. Yeah. You could have just told me. I wouldn't have been afraid of you or anything. I'm sorry. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. Well, that's a more at least, girl. It's different. But you do it now to protect yourself. And to protect me. 
I was sent to jail. Did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't? All the time. Okay, I think I'm about done. I can probably tear these pieces back with something. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. There, all set. Does it look dumb? <laughs> no, you look cute. And a lot harder to grab. All right. How do you feel? Good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far... Oh, shit! Hold on, everybody! Oh, oh, what? Well, that's just great. Fuck, 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 fuck! Maybe we could walk? That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm just saying. Hmm, I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. The thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. You gotta get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. This ain't shit. This. Yo, if you keep screaming like that, you're gonna get your face chewed off. Are you guys gonna be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. No, we're friendly. Put your hand down, kid. That's what everybody says. We know. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there. We won't let them escape. All right. We'll be down here. Leads up to that wreck tanker. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. Right. Real reassuring. A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now? What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. Look, you want to help us out? We could use some able bodies and... Yeah, we, we really need some help. What's in it? Oh, shit! God damn, you guys have a kid! What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Why oh, is so he excited about oh, the this kid? This is great! See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? I came across Clementine alone. The first day all of this happened, I was actually incarcerated. Sick. Do you have any prison tats? I uh, didn't make it that far. And everybody down there, they're cool? Kenny lost his wife and kid. Man, how long ago? What time is it? Uh, I don't know, uh, four? Maybe two hours ago. God damn. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. The train is awesome, though. A tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it, but if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We'd appreciate the help. 
You can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. Well, that's a really big gas tank. You know... It would be... <laughs> Damn it, we don't have any canisters. Folks probably had that way with that van a while ago. That's about the only useful thing in here. It's empty. Oh, good, we have full shit here to use it. Petroleum. Fuck. This thing is mangled to hell. No releasing it, no nothing. There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Let's go talk to your people, man. Oh, me? What? Am I gonna have to tell your people the plan, or what? Guys, this is Omid and Krista. Not big on welcomes? Like I said, we could use some good people. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we're not looking for charity. We could help you guys, though. Maybe. So, yeah. Hi. Uh, again? You know, want some candy? The plan is to cut that tanker down and be on our way. Seems like plan enough to me. You want to start in on that tanker? I'll get to know the girl for a minute, if you don't mind. And why don't I show you how this thing works, in case something happens? You really, kid? It's probably for the best. Someone might want to have a look inside of that station back there, too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. All right. I'm gonna get the for some bathroom break, so yeah.